we're feeling so good. We're getting back into the swing of things. <laughs> Finally, I know those are two together see, saying that. But I hey, know. we're back, baby. You guys, we have missed you. If you saw yesterday's video, we Ooh. moved to Costco. Yes, we and did. We're gonna get into a really fun video today, which we're super excited about. Something we've never done before. <laughs> yeah. Ever, ever. This is brand new, Justin, hot off the press. <laughs> and also, of course, we had to show you Finny because he hasn't yes. seen the video in a little oh bit. Oh my gosh. You guys, we hope you're all having a wonderful Sunday when you see this video. It's yeah. Sunday, it's Saturday. And it is a happening Saturday here. It is. The Intercoastal, as always, it has boats going down and up it. In fact, there are a ton of boats over here I in the think, harbor right there. I was say, the one time we come out here, yeah, like not there's a not a single right boat there. there. It has been just like traffic <laughs> nonstop, which you can tell it is like bright blue skies out. Yeah. It's in the 80s. It just feels good right now. This is like the perfect time here in Florida. I know we've said this so many times, but springtime is like the absolute best in Florida. Well, after Costco yesterday, you guys, we were obviously pretty tired. I saw one comment saying, how long did it take to get that all up to your apartment and put away? Luckily, we have our little wagon, like our beach yeah. wagon that we bring with us, so that helps a ton. It's this little bad boy right here. This is our wagon. Anyone who lives in an apartment, that is our best friend when we do big hauls. That thing has been through the ringer, I will say. Yeah. It lasted us a long time. We got it all put away and everything, but you guys, it was such a beautiful night. Cute yeah. outfit. I've been obviously at home for a few hours by himself, so we were like, you know what? Let's take the night. Let's go watch the sunset. It was beautiful. Finn. Oh my gosh. It was like the most beautiful night. The sun was setting. We actually took this little orange ball. It's his like new favorite thing ever. <laughs> and he just kept running back and forth. I've never seen Finn play that much on the beach. Like yeah, he, would just he had run so much so fun. Hard, grab it and then bring it back. But like we were just throwing that ball hard every single time and he was running in the sand. I know, no biggie. the sunset, it was like one of those rainbow where it was like the blues and the pinks. It was so beautiful. It was just so pretty. So yeah. that was such a fun start for us for our little weekend here. Obviously no one's here right now, you guys. Yeah, celebrate. It's, but you may have caught in our Costco video yesterday, we mentioned we are gonna be trying taste testing some of the new snacks at Costco or new things at least to us. Some of them are brand new or some of them are just new to us. And as I've been reading some of the comments, by the way, I know our video just went live. We said, "Give yeah. us your best name for." It's been like an official, you know, we haven't had time to read all the comments, but you know, we haven't seen. What we're I did about. say, I did see someone say, uh, "Jared's hand movement should not be happening like that." We were calling him Vanna White because he was like showcasing at our haul yesterday, which if you haven't seen that, go back and check it out. Let's get to the fun stuff, which, um, cuties, two of these things are not like the other. Like, I can't quite read this. Do you know why I can't read that? And this one looks a little like someone's opened it already. <laughs> you guys, I was laughing so hard. As I went to go get these to bring them out, I was like, Wait, Jared, did you open these already? And yep, I had uh, this one and that one. But you know what? You haven't seen my reaction yet. So you don't know if I like it or if I don't. But you've definitely not seen Brittany's reaction because she has not tried any of them. And I will admit, you guys may if you saw our haul. So this is something new. This is pickled okra, and let's just say this came in a pack of two, and um, oh, we literally ate the entire jar of these yesterday. You guys, if you are pickle fans, we'll just start with this one since we're talking about it. Yeah. If you are a pickle fan and you like a little bit of like heat. Let's just open this up. Yeah, open it up. Uh, oh. uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, wait. First try. <laughs> now, this is what they look like. Now I know I'm not the most appetizing, but that is all the spices. Let me pull one out for you. I have actually never had okra before this, so I didn't really know what to expect. It obviously has like all the little. I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't it. look good. <laughs> but. You gotta show them the inside. You just ate the whole thing. <laughs> I'll grab another one. <laughs> no, you eat the whole thing. Oh shoot, I didn't know I didn't know you were not supposed to eat the whole you thing. You haven't been eating the you can uh -huh. eat the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this taste test is going super well. Mm. Okay, but look inside. So there's like the little seeds, but you guys, it's like the perfect blend of pickles and like a little bit of like jalapeno flavor, would you say? They are so good. Like sweet and salty, but garlicky, and mm -hmm. I don't know all the stuff that's in here, but I'm just telling you, if you like pickle stuff, I feel like you will really like these. And it came in a big pack of two, so. A yes. super big win. 
kicking it off with those. I actually, I want one right now, but I'm gonna resist because I'm gonna be eating <laughs> sweet stuff here. Should, should we stick with the savory and try this little guy? Yes. All right, well, welcome to our little, what do we call this, our test table? <laughs> Like that, this is what we're trying up next right now. So the name of this, you guys, this is a new dip we've never tried. It is the chicken taco dip from Costco. So I'll tell you what's in it. It says with corn and jalapeno peppers. So mm. I'm assuming there's gonna be a bit of a kick to this, which we like a little bit of heat. I wonder if this would be good heated up or just cold. Now, when we were having them sampled, they were actually heating it up. Oh, they were? Yeah. We should heat it up. Yeah. And I but I, unfortunately, it. we were not able to sample it. Yeah, because it was all gone. Do you need your man to do it? Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, it smells good. It smells really good. Okay, hold. I'm going to go heat up a little bit of this in a bowl. We're gonna try this out in two ways. One heated and one cold. All right, here's a chip for you. Thank you. Are you doing cold or I'm gonna do cold, yeah. I'm gonna do hot. Actually, first. we're gonna do it yeah, hot. Wait, hot's always better. Oh, it's steamy. Hot. Okay. It smells really good. Yeah, it smells delicious. All right, here we go, Ray. That's good. It definitely has taco seasoning in it. Mm -hmm. It kind of reminds me of like a enchilada sauce, but spicier. Like I don't an know. Enchilada sauce queso. Queso. That's what it tastes like. Like an enchilada sauce at a restaurant with queso mixed in. And then there's like chunks of chicken in there and corn. Mm. Okay, so that was really good, warm. Now, let's see if it tastes just as good when it's cold. It's not that spicy though. It's not spicy at it's all. It's not spicy at all. So if you're afraid of heat and you're worried about that, this isn't that spicy. You like it cold? Yeah, I think I actually do like it cold. More? I might like it more. Really? Yeah. That's surprising. That's pretty good, huh? Mm -hmm. Sticking with savory stuff. Now, I know Jared's already tried this, but Maybe. I have not. <laughs> Maybe Finn got into it. This is, a, I hope <laughs> Finn didn't. This is mango habanero, which usually habanero is pretty spicy. I feel like, am I gonna need like a drink after this? No. No? No, I don't know actually, you know? Well, <laughs> you do know. No, I we might have gotten broken into it. Maybe someone just wanted Ooh. to try that out. It smells really good. It kind of smells like fruity, obviously with the mango. Okay, oh wow. That's really good. Oh, there's the heat. Oh, it's really good. Sorry, jerky takes a while to chew. Oh! So, yeah, there's definitely a kick with Whoa, this. Whoa, yeah. And it's delayed. There, there's a kick. It's a delayed kick. That's good. It starts off very sweet, mm -hmm. and that's the mango, and then there's a full on kick, and that's the habanero part. Mmm. The flavor is really good together, though. Mm hmm. I will say, if you're not a fan of heat, you won't like this. Just get other type of jerky, but I like that. So I've been tracking everything with my fitness pal. Huge benefit with this is that in one ounce, which is quite a bit, because I do weigh it, there's only 0.5, so 0 0.5 grams of fat, which is nothing. Five grams of carbs, and there's 10 grams of protein. Whoa! That's really good. <laughs> as far as like snacks and treats, this is a really good yeah, one. Yeah, so this is the healthy snack, you guys. Mm -hmm. And what we're about to try next is the not healthy stuff. <laughs> yeah. Does now, that, same that, guy who broke into our house and tasted these got into this one as well. Guys, this is what I was so looking forward and Jared won Costco yep. yesterday and found them at the last the minute. Day. And I'm so excited. So these are the Hershey's Cookies and Cream Pretzels. Mm -hmm. So it says crunchy, salty pretzels dipped and sprinkled for delight. Oh my gosh, I'm a huge, huge Hershey's Cookies and Creams fan. Like it's one of my favorite candy bars. So. I'm very excited to try these. Oh, it smells good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you wow, it's <laughs> like the very first time. <laughs> Look at that, all coated. Oh my gosh. Just delicious, yummy. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Mmm. Oh my gosh, everything I hope for more. It really is good. I know I've already had some of these last <laughs> night. But they're freaking good. You guys, <laughs> those are dangerous. It, it honestly tastes exactly like 
the Hershey's Cookies and Cream like bar, mm -hmm. and it just has a pretzel on it. It just has a salty like mm -hmm. taste to it with it. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Which who doesn't love a little chocolate and salt moment? And the crunch. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Those might be some of my new faves right there. That is so good. And then the best part with five pieces is only two grams of protein. <laughs> I will say that just cooled down my mouth though. Those are delicious. A huge win right there if you're looking for a fun new treat to try. That is definitely a winner. Now both of us haven't tried both of these. Which one should we start with? Mm. Start with the this banana. This we started with in our video yesterday. Okay, let's save that till the end. Let's start with this one because I'm really excited for that. So this one is Keep Snacking. They are dark chocolate dipped banana chips. So from what I can tell because they say they're crispy, they may be freeze dried is what I'm assuming since they say they're crispy, but let's open it up and see. And if obviously, if you don't like dark chocolate, you probably won't like it. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I gotta show you what these look like. So these look like banana chips, basically just dipped in chocolate. Oh, those are good. Wow. Okay. Wow. Those are good. Those are better than I expected. Think banana chip and then just dark chocolate. Mixed together, it's perfect. <laughs> it's like having dark chocolate M&Ms. It's kind of like a banana split, like a banana sundae, you mm -hmm. know, like with the banana with the chocolate ice cream. Wow. That's kind of what it reminds me of. But basically they're like banana chips. This is gluten-free, so if any of you out there are gluten-free, this is an awesome snack option for gluten-free. Oh, it says it's vegan too. Mm. I thought there'd be a little bit. Of Jerry, but guess not. You guys hear Finn whining right now? <laughs> this is so sad. Now this one, we have tested out. It's delicious. You I could know. say it's unreal. You guys, I know, <laughs> we don't have to try these, but basically, if you like Almond Joys and dark chocolate, yeah, these are dangerously good, mm -hmm. but they are, these are also gluten-free and they fully have less sugar than like their traditional Almond Joy. So kind of a healthier option. These are also non-GMO, no soy, certified vegan as well. So kind of has some better ingredients for you than something, so. You may have to try it out though, just to see what it looks like. <laughs> I mean, if we have to try one out. Fun Let's little see. snack size. I know, and they're individually wrapped, which is really nice, so. Oh, cheers it up again. So good, cheers. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Not the win. Well, these were unreal good. So cheesy. <laughs> but now, save me best for last. I'm sorry. I just ate that entire thing. It is so delicious. Now, this is how we roll, baby the cookie butter cookie bites. Mini graham sandwich cookie with peanut mm. butter, cream dipped in a chocolatey fudge topped with a peanut butter swirl. Wow. That was a mouthful. That is a mouthful. Now, let's. Get a mouthful of these. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Ooh. All right, all right. I like that. I like these little guys. They got a nice little swirl on them. Ah, okay. They smell like peanut butter. Cheers it up. Cheers. Oh, my God. <laughs> those are amazing. This is the best video we've ever yeah. made <laughs> for us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. Literally, take these, throw these in milk, and it would be the best cereal in the world. Oh my gosh, the graham cracker. That is so good. I never thought to take graham cracker with peanut butter and chocolate. Ooh. But it is a win. Only four cookies packs a lot of calories. Yeah, so. these are not health foods. <laughs> Let's uh, remember not that. These are to be health foods. These <laughs> no. are just fun treats. They are delicious though. It's always so fun to try new treats, you know? Well, that was delicious. So I think it's time for us to sit off our calories. <laughs> Gosh. Yeah. Jared with the cheesy jokes this like video. Those? My Thank gosh. You. I appreciate it. That was so fun to obviously eat and try all the fun new snacks that we got from our haul. I think we're gonna do this every time we do a Costco haul. We usually do them once a month. If you guys have any fun ideas for things we should try next, let us know down below. Also, like I have seen a few comments saying we should try like different protein drinks and things like that and do like taste tests and rate them and things like that. So let's know if that's something you'd be interested in. But this is kind of just a fun new type of video we wanted to do and put out there and obviously we enjoyed it. Hopefully you guys did too. Guys, this feels good to get back into the swing of things. We'll be putting out more videos so make sure you guys are subscribed, have those notification bells turned on. That's probably more important to have those things turned on especially. <laughs> but yeah, make sure you have those things turned on because we're gonna be posting more frequently, getting back into the swing of things. We're feeling good. 
soon. Feeling better. But for now, I think we're gonna go ahead and close out today's video. Thanks for tuning in for our little taste yeah. test. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, you guys, we love you all, and we'll see you all next see time. See you guys, love ya. Bye. Bye.